Hey everybody, it's Mr. 95 Cents. How we doing out there? Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, and everything else. What's going on? Oh, it's only a couple days before Christmas, and I'm going to be going for some kabooms later. And we got a lot of prizes today. We're going to do six prizes today. So, well, I added a couple things. So, we're going to have a lot of fun today. Show you a little bit of stuff uh, about the old store with Christmas and stuff. It should be pretty good. Hopefully, you guys got most of your shopping done. I think I got most of my done. I'm now in the wrapping mode. So, after this video, I'm going to go try to finish my wrapping. And then, I always got Christmas Eve if I forgot something. <laughs> and if it's a sports guy, I got stuff. So, I'm, I should be pretty well covered, I hope. All right. It's going to be busy. It's going to be busy. Uh, holidays are always busy around here. But before we start... I got a Christmas card with stuff in it. Oh, yeah. So this came from Jason. And he's one of our viewers. And he, he's won some stuff, I think, once in a while. Uh, he's Poor Man Stack on YouTube. So so I, I actually opened this already. And it says, Christmas is everywhere in our thoughts, in our hopes, and in our hearts. Very nice with the Christmas trees and the little thing over there. So I opened it up. Oh, look at this here. So it says, Merry Christmas to you and yours. Merry Christmas, Mr. D. Jason, not so poor man stack. Well, I know he's not poor. Uh, I think he's got a street named after him. So he's not poor, I can tell you that much. And he's got a lot of cards. And he sent me a couple nice cards. Look at this here. Now... Oh, this is, I remember this guy. 1975 tops, Bill Sudakis. I remember him. He wasn't bad. And then on the other side, we got a nice sticker of Goose Gossage right there. And then I got one here. I know I don't have this one. This is a uh, Bowman Chrome First Bowman from 2017. Tim Lynch autograph card. Uh, ooh, it's coming out of plastic. I don't have that one. Look at that. Very nice. It's actually got some kind of autograph. Not like a lot of new guys with just an X and O or something. So, thanks very much, Jason. I appreciate the thought. It's always nice to get something for the holidays. <laughs> thanks. Thank you very much. All right. So, we're going to start our prizes here. We got a bunch of tickets in here. Oh, there's a stack on the table just fell, which is not unusual. We got too many stacks. So here we go. We're going to mix them up. We got six prizes. Okay, so I'll show you the prizes first. First out of the box, we got the Chronicle Pack. Second out of the box, we got the Stained Glass Peyton Manning card from Prism. Third out of the box, we got the Green Prism from uh, Travis Kelsey from Prism Draft Picks. Fourth out of the box, we got the Panini Crusade Rookie of Mike Evans. Then I added a couple. Fifth out of the box, we're going to do a 2021 Gypsy Queen pack. And I, 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 I tell you, this card was sharp. So sixth out of the box, you're getting a, prism, a Panini Prism Blue Cracked Ice Eddie Matthews card. That's a sharp card right there. All right. So we're going to hand mix them first. Six prizes now. Six prizes. There's a bunch of comments, but I figure you got at least a 10 to 1 shot. At least. Which is not bad. Better than the lottery. All right. We're going to shake it up. All right. All right. Good luck. Here we go. We're going for the pack first. Oh, I got to make sure I only got one. All right. Our winner of the pack is... Hey, Jay's Mix. Hey. Alex. Alex, you got something. Ooh, that's a good excuse for me to send you more stuff. <laughs> All right. Alex has got the... Chronicle football. Now we're going to go with a paint, paint manning stained glass. All right, let's see here. Oh, random rips. Random rips. Right there. Random rips wins the paint manning. All right. Let me just get these set up over here. All right. Here we go. All right. We're going for the Travis Kelsey. There it 
is. Here it is. Red rum. Hey, red rum. Red rum. Josh won the Travis Kelsey. There you go. All right. We're going for the Mike Evans. Here it comes. Callie and Jordan. Hey, Callie and Jordan. There we go. You got the Mike Evans coming. All right, we're going for the pack. Oops, here it comes. Oh, Luke. Luke wins the pack. Luke. <laughs> right there. And then we're going for the Eddie Matthews. Pack dice. Oh, Paul in the 6194. There he goes, Paul. I know he likes the Padres, but this is a nice Eddie Matthews car, Paul. <laughs> All right, and that's our six winners for our holiday special here. All right. So, hey, you like my, my Santa hat? So I'm shopping at ShopRite, uh, trying to get the last-minute things going and everything, and they had these hats on sale. They were, six, I think, six ninety nine. They were marked down to three ninety nine. And I like it. <laughs> so it's good. All right. We're going to go to Warehouse Finds. All right. So we got a bunch of stuff here. Let's see. And we're going to show you some prizes for this video that we're going to give away next video. All right. Here we go. So I ran into a whole box of these. I pulled a few of them uh, just to show you. This, this was one of my favorite sets back in the day. The pack sold so well, I didn't get left with too many. But I did find some. Uh... I think I, I probably bought a load and this was in it, a stack of these. So I pulled a few interesting ones. This was from 2013, Tops, uh, celebrating their uh, 75, 70, wait, I'm wrong, 75th anniversary. Yeah, Top 75 was the set. Top 75. All right. So I, I don't know about 75th anniversary, but it's a Top 75th. So I imagine it's the anniversary. All right even though I think they started in 1951, right? But that doesn't add up to 75 years, does it? I don't know. But anyway, they're remakes of original cards, and they're very nice. I'll show you. And it could be anything, non-sports, sports, whatever. I got a Bazooka Joe. Remember Bazooka Joe? Yeah, Bazooka Joe card back in the day. Got a Bart Simpson. Because Topps over the years has made... So many sets, it's ridiculous. Uh, almost anything. We got a uh, Alf. Just about anything that was popular or, or trend setting, they uh, made a card. Zorro. I remember watching Zorro as a kid. Yeah. I remember watching this as a kid, too. Lost in Space with the evil professor and the robot. Oh, this is a good one. Good times. Here he goes. That was a good show. And then we got, oh, this is nice. The Beatles. And that. We got Happy Days with Fonzie. Here he is. Oh, this is, a, boy, they look real. Except for that 75 thing in the corner, that looks just like a like a 66 Batman card. Look at that. Oh, we got oops, I dropped it. Kung Fu. I remember that show. And then the Mod Squad. That's the original Mod Squad. I know they had a, a movie, a newer movie, but this is the original. That was a popular show too, the Mod Squad. All right, but I got a lot of those. I'm going to be showing them periodically. Look at these over here. And I, hopefully I'll get to some sports ones. All right, we got some hockey. We got a, a, oh, this is nice. World Junior from 93 Sweden, Adam Denmarsh. Oh, I remember these. The Pacific Aurora. We got a Mike Vernon. They, they were nice. This is a base card. And it's got, like, him etched in gold. They were nice cards. They gave us nice cards for cheap back then. This pack might have been $3 a pack back then. 
We got uh, an upper deck World Junior grads. Let me see if I can pronounce his name. Andre Vasilevsky or something. <laughs> From Russia. And we got another one of those guys. Oh, this is nice. This is from Synergy. Stars of the show. Andre, the same guy. The shiny card. Now, uh, this is funny. So we got these power shifts uh, from the older SP. They're from uh, 1999. They were like a, like a parallel type of thing. And there was different power shifts. So we got the regular power shift of uh, Peter Bondra. It's got the power shift thing in the corner. And then we got a numbered one, but this is funny. This is uh, Alexei Yashin. And it's numbered to 500, but it's like smeared. <laughs> I guess the rink wasn't too good. Yeah. Oh, this is uh, some older finest. These are 96, 97 finest. Just regular cars. We got a Gihu Bear. And we got a Chris Terreri. Okay, basketball. Let's see here. Oh, we got a nice uh, 97 98 Fleer Allen Iverson Rookie of the Year card. One of my uh, friends went to, I think, the, uh, the basketball down. I don't know, it was a basketball game, NBA game. I think it was down south. And uh, he was sitting like uh, a few seats away from Allen Iverson. All right. Oh, this is the bazooka, the old bazooka. This is the four-player uh, cards, four player sticker. And one of them is a rookie. We got a Dwight Howard rookie in there with the stickers. These were nice. These were Skybox Premium cards, and they had Team Skybox cards. We got a David Robinson and the Kim Olajuwon. We got some, uh, oh, some Giannis coming up. Uh, uh, Hoops Frequent Flyer, Giannis, who wanted that basketball. You see him go after that basketball? I don't blame him. <laughs> he should have first dibs. He scored a lot of points. Uh, we got an NBA hoops. Uh, what are they calling this? Get out of the way insert. That's a sharp insert. Get out of the way, Giannis. And um, we got some Jordans. So this is a 2012-13 uh, Fleer Retro Basketball, Michael Jordan, when he was with uh, North Carolina. Got an older collector's choice. I always like that card. He's got the the face in there. Guy was an intense player. Yeah. We got a, uh, this is Jordan's 55 points gives Chicago a 3-1 series lead in the NBA Finals. And we got a couple, looks like uh, Goodwin Champions. There's a Goodwin Champions, Michael Jordan. And here's another one that's got them all dressed up. All right, what do we got here? Some older football. Okay, looks like we got 1986 tops. Looks like Chiefs and Falcons we got. All right, let's see what we got here. We got a Deron Cherry. I think he played. Did he play for Rutgers? He played for Rutgers right down the road in Jersey here. Ron Cherry, I remember him. Got a Carlos Carson. Got a duplicate already. We got a uh, the in action. It's Blackledge. Blackledge was their quarterback. We got a Herman Hurd. Stephon Page. And we're going to Falcons. We got a Rick Donnelly on the Falcons. Rick Bryan. Mike Ken. We got a William Andrews. 
a Gerald Riggs. We got an in action uh, Riggs around the end. Those in action cards were nice. All right, we got some more modern cards here. Who's who we got? Who we got? Odell. I guess Odell's back uh, back playing again, right? We got some rookies of him. We got a prestigious uh, picks. That's a sharp card, Odell uh, rookie. And we got a. Uh, Oh, what sets this from? This is from Prestige. Prestige draft pick rookie of Odell. We got a Panini Crusade rookie card of Odell. We got a Bowman Chrome rookie card of Odell. Hey, he was a hot commodity back in the day. Now I... I put all those cards together. Maybe I get nine ninety five. You never know. <laughs> we got oh, this is nice. This is a, a, a Topps Platinum Stefan Diggs rookie. Never know what we're gonna find in the boxes. Oh, Jimmy Garoppolo. All right, who's backup now? Right. We got a, a Topps Finest rookie card of Jimmy Garoppolo. Got a Bowman rookie card. Oh, this guy's pretty good. We got a, a Panini draft pick uh, Prism Crusade, Michael Parsons rookie. That's nice. And then we got some Devontae Adams. We got a Topps Chrome Devontae Adams rookie. We got a Rookies and Stars rookie card of Devontae Adams. We got a Sage Hit Devontae Adams. And we got a score rookie card of Devonta Smith. So we're here. Baseball. We got a lot of baseball. Okay, so this was a weird card. We found a Topps Heritage Minor League. Nolan Arenado. Uh, this is from 2011. Playing for the Modesto Nuts. That's some, that's some name. The Modesto Nuts. They got some crazy minor league names. This was also a, a Topps Heritage card. Uh, rookie game card of Francisco Lindor. We got a nice uh, Topps Heritage uh, from 2020. Randy Rose Arena. We got a Topps Chrome rookie card of Jordan Alvarez. Oh, these are in, this is the Upper Deck Gowdies, right? Yeah, uh, that's my Max Scherzer rookie from Upper Deck Gowdy, and a Clayton Kershaw from the same set. Got a Stadium Club Eloy Jimenez rookie. Oh, this is nice. Tops Allen and Ginter, Chris Bryant rookie. Now we got a rainbow foil uh, from Tops rookie card of Austin Riley. And a Tops Chrome rookie card of Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Now we got a bunch of cards here. So we have some national cards. Uh, these were given out in 2012 in Baltimore. All right. And uh, I think they're all baseball. All right. So this was, uh, it's a Leaf set. It was uh, given out. Sports Collector Convention, Baltimore, 2012. So we got a Red Shane Deanst. I got a bunch of these too, I found. A Ferguson Jenkins. It's a pretty big set. We got Orlando Cepeda. Dennis Eckersley, Andre Dawson, Bruce Souter, we got Don Sutton, Reggie Jackson, 
Will Clark, and Gaylord Perry. I got a bunch more of those, too. I'll be showing you in the future. It's a big set. And it's weird. They're all... I don't know how many's in the set. It's all the player's initials and then one. And that's for every card. Player's initials. Here's Gaylord Perry. Oh, actually, no, wait. Gaylord Perry, too. So I guess maybe they made multiples. Yeah. There's Will Clark one. So I've only seen one or two cards. That's it. All right. We got, oh, we got some 1958. Uh, looks like some Cardinals and some Pirates. We got a Lloyd Merritt from 1958. Eddie Casco. Got a little glare going on because I got the other computer on because I'm going to show you something in a few minutes. Got a Maury Martin. Got a Joe Cunningham. We got some Pirates. We got a Gene Baker. A Don Gross. Oops, Don Gross. Got another... Oh, wait, that was Bob Friend, sorry. The Don Gross was stuck in front of it. Bob Friend was a pretty good pitcher, too. Don Gross. Bob Skinner. Harding Peterson. And Dick Grote. And on the back is always a comic. Let's see what it says. This one's not in great shape, but let's take it out and see. What's going on there? Come on. Oh, come on out. It's coming. All right, so they, they put a comic on the back. Let's see. At Duke University, Dick was an all-American star, and he was the best hitting nationally shortstop last year. Not bad. Well, here he's got a uh, he had 315 that year, and he has a 285... Uh, Lifetime. Yeah, he was good. I remember him. He played into the 60s, so... Cause I, I really didn't start watching uh, baseball, I think about 1961, when I got a little older. I started watching on the black and white TV. <laughs> All right. And we're going to go right to uh, card shop stories. So, a couple different things on card shop stories. Uh, a couple people commented, your eBay's closed. Well, yeah, we... We closed, I think, last Saturday was the last day that you could hope to get something uh, guaranteed in the mail by Christmas, uh, according to the United States Postal Service. So I waited till Monday. Uh, my eBay shut off on Sunday, uh, well, Monday, midnight, mon Monday, Sunday, whatever. Uh, first thing Monday morning, it shut off. And then I got whatever mail came in and we, set, we shipped it out on Monday. And, uh, you know, that's cutting it close because if you're in California, I know it takes at least four or five days. So, uh, and I do that for a reason. I never did that when I had the store because, you know, we had to max out our potential you know, or whatever, try to pay the bills, you know, pay the payroll and everything else. But now that I'm semi-retired, I don't have to do that. So, uh, you know, and, and I, it was fun, but... Almost every Christmas Eve, it wouldn't be fun because there would be, would be somebody, one or two people, because we sold a lot of stuff online. There would be one or two people that didn't get their stuff in time for Christmas. And we're very prompt with the mail. We mail out usually the next day. So, uh, and I still remember um, going up to my brother's house, which I'm doing this year too, and uh, you know, we're having our Christmas Eve festival. You know, a lot of Italians do that with the, the big dinner and everything. And, uh, f you know, for us, Christmas Eve is bigger than Christmas, pretty much. We actually open our presents Christmas Eve. So, uh, we, and the whole family gets together. But I still remember I'm, I'm up there and I get out of my car and a message comes on. A lady out in California is irate because I ruined her son's Christmas, she didn't get her package. So I looked, she ordered it like three days before. 
and we had options for faster shipping. She did not pay for them. So what am I supposed to do? You know? Uh, so I said, boy, if I ever like retire or something, you know, I knew I would never retire from the internet, you know, as far as eBay, I got too much stuff. But I says, I'm, I'm going to uh, cut that out. So that's why I, there's been nothing for sale. <laughs> the store is closed. This way I have a peaceful Christmas Eve with no complaints, you know. So, uh, and hopefully everybody that ordered, you know, Saturday, Sunday, that got mailed out Monday, you got a good chance of getting it, you know, so I shouldn't have any problems. Uh, it will turn on again. The eBay store will turn on again. I believe I, I turned it on uh, Christmas Eve uh, at, at like midnight or something. So it'll be on for Christmas Eve. And you know, this way I can enjoy a holiday when when somebody orders something on Christmas Eve, I don't have to mail it out until I think the Wednesday is the deadline. They give you they don't count the the uh, Saturday, Sunday, or Monday. So and we have a two day ship. So and I'll probably get it out on Tuesday. But this way I, I can enjoy my holiday. <laughs> so that's that. That's why I answered that question. Why the uh, stores closed? eBay stores closed uh, this week. So for five days or whatever. So anyway, I, I, I thought I'd share this video. Some of you guys probably already seen this video. It's on my channel. It's from 10 years ago. Uh, we used to do a lot of incredible things in the store. Uh, our biggest thing for the holidays was our sports page holiday auction and free mini pack war. Imagine sitting there, uh, auction items, a lot of them starting at 95 cents, uh, free packs with prizes, food, everything. We we took care of our customers, I can tell you that much. You know, we appreciated our customers and every Christmas we do this and it was a lot of fun. So I'm gonna show you, see if I can aim it right. It's like a one minute and change video, but this is an advertisement, this is an advertisement for the event. So I'll show you. Hello everybody, it's bigger 95 cents. It's that sports page in beautiful downtown Mars Plain, New Jersey. I'm here to wish everybody a happy holiday and invite you to our, ooh, we got a big event going on tomorrow, Saturday, December 14th. We got the free mini pack for an auction holiday party going on here at the sports page. It's all free to come down. And if you want to bid, we got a, about 90 items going up on auction. About half of them start at 95 cents. Plus, we're giving out a lot of free packs every hour on the hour. We got a free mini pack war with a lot of packs. Pack, pack, packs we got. And we're going to be giving out free chocolate Santas. Oh, look who's here with the chocolate Santas. <laughs> so come on down to the sports bridge. It's tomorrow, Saturday, December 14th. And it's going to be starting at 2 o'clock. But the viewing is at 1 if you want to see the auction items. Take care now. Have a good one. We'll see you later. Have a happy holiday. <laughs> That's, that still makes me smile. You know, we used to, we used to have a good time. Uh, that was Ryan, who now uh, is a big shot for JSA with operating the Santa. <laughs> and... Well, I upgraded my hat anyway, I think. I have a, a color, more colorful hat, uh, but I have less gray in that picture because that's at least 10 years ago. So that was always a great event and a lot of fun, you know. And some people, uh, that was usually a week or two before Christmas. So that a lot of people relied on that to do the Christmas shopping, you know, because it was a great price, you know. A lot of items start at 95 cents, and we used to pack the house. I mean, that, I think comfortably uh, that store, uh, that was actually Mars Plains. Yeah, that was Mars Plains. We we uh, comfortably probably sat 40-some people, you know. So we would have all the seats filled, and some people would be standing. So and they went through a lot of food, a lot of cookies. <laughs> so... So that was a lot of fun. I, I do miss that part of the store. I, I don't miss being locked up every day because although I, I enjoyed my job, sometimes if I wanted to go someplace, I was locked up and I couldn't go. So, so you know, I I, I, I miss that kind of stuff with the customers, but I, I don't uh, miss, I, I enjoy the freedom I have now. Let's put it that way. So, and that's our 
card shop story for the holidays. We hope everybody has a Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah. I know I'm going to have a lot of fun. <laughs> All right. Oh, now. So I think you know, originally I said four packs we're going to do. We're going to do three packs because there's 12 packs. That will bring me right to New Year's, right before New Year's. So this way I'm opening, looking for kabooms for the whole holiday because here, after Christmas, the holiday don't stop. We just keep having fun. So we're going to try it. And they give you 20 cards per pack, which is a lot of cards. Let's see here. We did okay last time. We got a two a rookie and a couple of them. We got the uh, two a green. All right, let's see. We got Adrian Peterson. Miles Sanders. We got a Von Miller. Terry McLaurin. We got Deshaun Jackson. Teddy Bridgewater. Okay, we got something here, and it's not numbered, but it's a uh, some kind of swirly prism card. I don't know if the guy's any good, though. Jared Pinckney. I've never really heard of him. Rookie card from the Falcons. But that's, I think it's the first time we got one of those. We got a green Julio Jones. A green, oh, Dwayne Haskins. That's the kid that got killed. Oh, jeez. An upside down card. What do we got? Okay. We got a, a green rookie card of James Proach. We got a stargazing Dalvin Cook. We got an introductions Justin Jefferson. A KG Hambler rookie. A Denzel Mims rookie. A Quez Watkins rookie. A Jake Luton rookie. A.J. Terrell rookie. John Hightower, the fourth rookie. A lot of rookies. Noah Ingenomi, whatever the name is, rookie. And J.K. Dobbins rookie. All right. And the kid reporter. All right, so nobody gigantic there, but not bad. You know, they give you a lot of cards. here all right let's see next pack jimmy garoppolo which we saw some of his rookies before ben rosseberger jared stidham we got aaron Rodgers. marquise brown got mike evans travis kelsey we got a green teddy bridgewater a green to Sean Watson. All right. We got a green rookie of Marlon Davidson. Marlon Davidson. I got a squirrel out there. I don't know if you can hear him. He's making noises. <laughs> I got a lot of squirrels out there. We got a fantasy flashback Terrell Davis. That's a nice card. You get some nice answers. A stargazing Odell. We showed some rookie cards of him, too. We got a rookie card of a Michael Perrine. A Desmond Patman rookie. A T. Higgins rookie. That's not bad. James Proach. An Anthony McFarlane Jr. rookie. A Josh Uch rookie. Dalton Keene's rookie. And a Steven Montez rookie. All right, they got a lot of rookies in this set. But it's not easy to get like a Tua. Especially that last batch I had, a Tua green. That's tough to do. There's so many rookies. There must, must be 100 rookies in this set. All right, last pack for today anyway. Got a Mari Cooper. Got a Matthew Stafford. Got a Stefan Diggs, Anthony Miller, got a Mike Gazecki, Michael Thomas, a Baker Mayfield, a Frank Clark Green, a Khalil Mack Green. Okay, I got some upside down. Okay. It's a, a green rookie of Damon Arnett. 
the introduction, Jonathan Taylor, an unsung hero, Zadarius Smith. We got a Gabriel Davis rookie, Trevon Diggs rookie, a Clyde Edwards Hilaire rookie, Kyle Duggar rookie, Devin DeVernay rookie, a Ross Blaylock rookie, James Morgan rookie, and an Anthony Gordon rookie, and a, a Kid Reporter, which are out of date. All right, well, not as good as I did the first three packs, but we got six more packs to go, two more videos. I got to get that kaboom. But there's a lot of rookies. I'm just realizing there's a load of rookies in that, so... You know, people look to make sets. So I think last time, uh, out of the, except for the two, I think the two I ended up giving to somebody, uh, I packaged up those rookies and like a lot of like 15 rookies and put them out for sale on eBay. <laughs> Somebody's look at cheap. Somebody's looking to make the set. So, and that's, that's our box break. So, and that's about it for today because I got to get back to wrapping presents and stuff. You know, I mean, we're getting there. Tomorrow's the day. So, for me, uh, I'll have a little bit tomorrow during the day, but I think we got to be on the road by 4 o'clock. And the, uh, the sleigh goes on the road 4 o'clock and probably won't come back till 1 o'clock in the morning, but it's going to be a lot of fun. <laughs> All right, so we got prizes for the next video. So if you're a subscriber and you comment on this video on Tuesday, the day after Christmas, you got another chance for winning prizes. So first out of the box will be the uh, green prism Tom Brady from Mosaic. That's a nice card. Second out of the box, we got the uh, 91 Fleer Ultra Rookie of Brett Favre. Third out of the box, we got a Rookie of the Year from Contenders, Justin Jefferson. And I, I like these cards. Fourth out of the box, we got the Touchdown Masters. I call them like the big head cards. Dak Prescott. They're cool cards. So all you got to do is comment on, the, comment on this video. And next video, we got a chance to win those prizes. All right. And that's about all I got. I got to start wrapping the presents. Hopefully, everybody has a Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. Anything else you celebrate. Have a good time. Yep, it's going to be fun. And uh, that's pretty much it. Don't forget now. Now, for the holiday, you might want to splurge a little bit. <laughs> it's the holiday. But try not to go too much over to 120. <laughs> a box. Because what we're getting out of this stuff ain't really that worth it, you know. And buy what you like. Because if it goes up or down, you still like it. All right. Thanks a lot, everybody. Have a happy holiday, everybody. Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. We'll see you next on Tuesday. Take care.